Yes, I know. I'm a powerful self-taught mage. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Well, all right, I can finally give Harold his sword back. It has been one of the most reliable things that I've had oh. since I've what been happened? here. But now I have my own personal ebony short sword that I'm going to be using in place of Harold's sword. So let me find out. Where is he? I think he was, he's over here at uh, Mr. Bell Key. And, um, oh yeah. Chardra, good morning. That armor looks good on you. Looks like you're coming up in the world. I'm glad to see you're spending your um, hard earned gold. More stuff that matters to you. But it's important, though. Important to have a decent shield. But you know what else? I think I finally have enough money to buy the home. I have crafted swords, armor, alchemy. I've been doing it all. And I think it's finally time. Where is Harold? Is he in here? Oh. Okay, he's... I think he's somewhere back there. Excuse me, Harold. Out of my way. The son of the Jarl has no time for idle conversation with travelers. Maybe I should consider selling your sword instead, but... Here it is, Mr. Smartmouth. The sword that you wanted me to get from Balaman months ago. Thank you. It served me well. Took your sweet time getting it to me. Yes, I Here did. Here you go, for your trouble. Oh, diamonds and amethyst. All right, then. You seem to dislike visitors in Riften. Every day, the threat of exile from Riften draws closer for myself and my family. Who knows how many spies the Empire has sent into our midst already? We're at war. This isn't the time for hospitality. Thank goodness Mother is keeping a level head about everything. If my brother Sayerlund had his way, we'd be flying Imperial colors by now. All right, well. All right, then. Yeah, thank you for the gems. All right, Chandra. Well, that's, uh... I guess we need to find something to... Oh, the house. I think I have the gold. Let me see. Yes. More than enough. Anuriel. Welcome to Mistvale Keep. I'm Jarl Layla's steward, Anuriel. I'd like to purchase the house in the city. Splendid. There's a house available right now. I'll take it. Wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. Finally. Finally. Oh, divines. Thank you. You're welcome in Riften, as long as you continue to obey our laws. All right. You want to check out my new house? Come on. Well, it's too bad Brynjewin, uh... Went back to Whiterun, he never got a chance to see this house. 
But it was hard. Let me see. How much gold do I have left? Oh, I still, still got some gold. Is it absolutely necessary for you to bother me right now? Seriously? Do you want me to punch you out again? I didn't think so. Come on, let's go see the house. Before I end up getting arrested. Can you believe this? I finally have a house of my own. A roof over my head and water is not dripping down. Look at this. Wow, I wonder if anybody left anything valuable behind. It's a lot of cobwebs in here. I guess I have to fix her up. Needs a lot of fixing. Can you believe it? All this space. Wow, well, I hope you'll come visit me. I know you're not far away. I mean, you can even stay here if you want to, if you have a fallen out with them. Um, Half Greer. Oh my, is this my view? This is my... Oh, people can come up here though. No, I don't like this. Well, I have to keep the door locked. But yeah, look at this. You come out. Look at that view. Well. Well, thank you, Chandra. I mean, you, you helped out a lot. we need to uh, keep ourselves busy. Hmm, I need a kitchen, food, lots of stuff has to be done. But this is a start. So, I wonder if my mysterious uh, person left something. Wait a minute. Seriously? Who would leave? This is Meridia's beacon. Somebody left for me? This doesn't. All right, I'm going to take it. I think. We have a mission. It's a very uh, subtle or unsubtle way of telling me that we need to go to uh, Meridia's temple. Hmm. Who would be doing this? Or what? Bowley? That's a vampire. It's another vampire that I had to kill. So, fortunately, there haven't been any more vampire attacks. I haven't seen any. But you be on guard. Be ready. All right. Let's find Meridia's temple. Let's go. Look at my temple lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. If they love me not, how can my love reach them? Well, 
I'd say we found it. Come on. I'm not sure why I'm here. A new supplicant approaches. Oh boy. Listen. What? Hear me and obey. A foul darkness has seeped into my temple. A darkness that you will destroy. But first, you must restore to me my beacon. I shall guide you unto it. Find it and return here. And great shall be your reward. Well, as it so happens, Something put your beacon in a barrel outside of my house. There. Ooh, what? What's going on? It is time for my splendor to return to Skyrim. But the token of my truth lies buried in the ruins of my once great temple. Now tainted by a profane darkness skittering within. The necromancer Malkarin defiles my shrine with vile corruptions, trapping lost souls left in the wake of this war to do his bidding. Worse still, he uses the power stored within my own token to fuel his foul deed. I have brought you here, mortal, to be my champion. You will enter my temple, retrieve my artifact, and destroy the Defiler. Um, w well, uh... Um... Yeah, it doesn't really sound like I have a choice in the matter. But a single candle can banish the darkness of the entire void. If not you, then someone else. My beacon is sure to attract a worthy soul. But if you are wise, you will heed my bidding. Go now. The artifact must be reclaimed and Malkarin destroyed. Malkarin has forced the door shut, but this is my temple, and it responds to my decree. I will send down a ray of light, guide this light through my temple, and its doors will open. Okay. Oh. Oh, wow. All right, I'm back. Are you ready? What, what I, Okay, I can't... Can't interact with that. Alright, somewhere... There's a... Yeah, down here. Oh! Oh, my feet! Oh, okay, I burned them. healing there yeah that's much better okay here we go hmm. desecrated corpses they're carrying a fair amount of gold I still can't believe I own home now.
it just seemed like I was supposed to pull that. Ancient Nord Sword. Is there a booby trap here? I don't see one. Steel soldier boots. Eh, I don't think they're worth that much. Alright, let's go. open. Come on. I don't think I like where this is going. I don't either. I have a bad feeling. level. Got him. Oh! Look out. There's another one. More right, Chandra, let me help you. Iron Flash. Look at the level of that thing. Yeah. All right, it's not that tough. This is the end for you. It's too powerful. Look out, look out. Requires a key. All right, I think this is the way. Come on. Wait a minute. Another. Who has a key? Do this thing. All right. Well, this door opened over here. Come on. But it looks like we can't get through. Oh, wait, what? Look out. Who else is here? Yeah. I'll take these daggers though. Sword. All right.
I'm a magic resistance, I know that. But I will take the soul gem. Oh, oh. that good. Okay, it looks like the only way we might have to jump. Oh, well, we could go up the stairs. No, no guards out here. Look at this. Look at the size of this chest. Oh, an ebony bow. Chandra, come on. Some of them, some shades. All right, I don't understand how this works. Conduit spell held in one hand into the weapon held in the other. View the effects under active effects. Only one conduit strike effect can affect a target at a time. Is 
Now maybe... So what if I... Alright, I'm... <clears throat> Get out. I guess I can't do it in here. Why won't you die? Where is he? I think he's up top somewhere. Come on. Chandra. Feel this. There you are, look at you. Come on. Oh. Oh, great. Okay, come on. Jumping. Keep your eyes and ears open. There's a shade down there. There's a smart shade. Oh, you're okay. How'd you get down there so quick? I have to come down here too. Yes, I know. I'm a powerful self taught mage. Come on. Open this though. All right, we got to go back upstairs.
So, wait, didn't I? Maybe I activate that one. Yeah. Okay, it looks like up top there, maybe? Can't really tell how this is supposed to go. Wait. Maybe I'm supposed to jump through here? Sword. Chandra, get him. stairs over here. Magic resistance. Okay, so I think it's back on the other side. Wait. my sword. Okay, doors open. All right, I'm jumping down. Time to re up on Iron Flash. Okay, let's go.
his brawler's elven gauntlets, increases unarmed damage of humans and elves by five. I don't think I can learn that though, but anyway. Let's go. I don't think I like where this is going. Oh, that must be Malker in there. should tell you to stay back. Oh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. No! Oh, look out! Get what gold you can off these bodies. This oh malign paralysis poison. So what does Malkarin have? A steel dagger and a soul gem. In his shade? Was that it? What, what was... Wait, didn't Malkarin have... Huh, none of these... Uh, there's nothing really valuable. Alright, well, wait, wait. Oh, here we go. Well... So... I'm supposed to get this weapon, Dawnbreaker. All right, here we go. This again? Malkarin is vanquished. Skyrim's dead shall remain at rest. This is as it should be. This is because of you. A new day is dawning, and you shall be its herald. 
Take the mighty Dawnbreaker, and with it purge corruption from the dark corners of the world. Wield it in my name, that my influence may grow. All right, I will wield this mighty blade in your name. May the light of certitude guide your efforts. Okay. Chandra. Oh, there he is. I don't feel right. No, oh, no. What happened? You fell? Oh, uh, you look all right. So, looks like this is over. And let's see what this sword is all about. Dawnbreaker deals 40 sun damage to the undead. Undead targets below half health have the chance to explode for 200 sun damage. Targets on fire take extra damage over time. So, whoever or whatever put that beacon in the barrel outside of my house wanted me to get this sword. I can imagine that this would be a great weapon to use against the vampires. Because they, they are really getting out of control and somebody's gonna have to stop them. It might as well be me.